Hey, what's going on, guys? Uh, it's been a little bit of, it's been a while since I've uh, been on the last and just wanted to give you guys an update. So, I can't remember what the last thing that I said was. That's how long it's been, and that's not good to do that. But uh, I found a truck. It's a 2004 F-150 with an 8-foot bed. thing was garage-kept. Uh, seems like it's going to be a really good truck for me. The, uh, there's hardly any rust on it. And this is going to be a good truck to uh, wrap. So uh, I'm excited about that. I still haven't made my design on, on the wrapping. I still have to get with them. But I did drop my truck off in Louisville, which is uh, a couple of hours from me. And uh, Russ down there at Southside Equipment is uh, making a skid for me so i bought a 5.5 gallon uh this is a soft wash uh system 5.5 gallon pressure washer and then i'm a downstream with that i have a, a 55 gallon tank and a 50 gallon tank or a 100 gallon tank and a 50 gallon tank i also have some uh reels uh for all my soft washing uh, hose, I think I get three hoses, and I also have a 12 volt, 8 uh, gallon a minute uh, pump for roof washing. So, that is that. Now, as far as my hiring went, the main guy that I wanted was, uh, I don't know if I scared him off. I may have scared him off because I had this gut feeling that. He was taking his time getting a hold of me, and that kind of uh, scared me a little bit. So the night before, I texted him, or I called him, and I said, listen, I said, I have to know if I've got the right guy, because I don't want to invest a lot of money in you. This wasn't for verbatim, but I think I got my point across that uh, I just didn't want to waste his time or my time if he didn't think he was on board enough and uh, give me you know 100 percent and uh i posted this in a facebook group and they said there's no way he's gonna give you 100 percent, and you can never expect that from an employee so uh, i backed off and they're probably right so i may have scared him off but also at the same time you know i said i'm gonna do a drug test and a drive you know check out his driving record and everything else he may have had some record in the past that he didn't want to show up and he just didn't want to uh, go through all that and he was embarrassed maybe. I don't know. If that could be a possibility. I'm not sure. But that is kind of where I'm at right now. So today is Tuesday, the second day of my new hire, which I did find another guy. A little rough around the edges, but see if we're going to polish them up. Um... I did get a new CRM, uh, the customer factor, because I heard so much about it. So far, I like a lot of the things, but uh, it didn't transfer over all my QuickBooks stuff very seamlessly, let's just put it that way. So I've got a lot of kinks to work out. I have to figure out the email automation because uh, people are getting tons of emails, and I didn't want that because that bothers them. So I turn them all off. I'm going to have to fix that work that out um so much going on and like i said today is tuesday and thursday it is uh the myrtle beach there's a free class there at myrtle beach that uh i guess south side equipment's going to be there um jamie schmidt uh is going to be there from new jersey so i'm going to go do that class so i'll be in myrtle beach this weekend from thursday to sunday or at least i'm leaving here thursday coming back sunday and also uh, i am going to be going on march 4th and 5th i believe the dates were to the nashville event so uh, i'm going to get all these classes and information and learning done before the season starts with the soft wash because this is all new ball game for me. I do have, however, some <clears throat> clients that are already interested, so that's good. Just 
it's good for me because I've been in window washing business for long enough. I mean, I feel like I'm a startup right now, but I do have a base of customers where I can start out, you know, start out from. So, which is nice. Uh, it's a little kickstart. So, but uh, yeah. So I just let you guys know everything uh, that I'm doing. Hopefully, I'm going to be putting up some more training videos soon because uh, I'm going to be training my guy and he's going to be videotaping me so I can put that up on uh, YouTube for you guys as well. Um, so I think that's all I got for now and uh, we will talk to you guys later. Bye.